All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. Um, that should be good there. That should be good there too. Today we're doing a little bit, something a little bit different. Um, I know that we're, I left off at a travel vlog somewhere in Egypt, but um, funny thing happened with that, at least the footage, most of the footage uh, from that trip. I'll get into that later though, but right now I'm actually, setting up I need a hose I need this so i'm actually doing a car review my first car review on my car you know with no better car to start out on uh 2020 corolla hatchback a car i've owned it for like four months now it's actually pretty impressive so i figured i'd do a car review and i called over my friend mark he's on his way over here now just prepping uh to do a car wash scene i think i might incorporate in the review i'm not sure yet and I mean, look at this, the, the car needs a wash anyway. So I figured, you know, great opportunity for some uh, really cool slow-mo, soapy slow-mo. And um, I couldn't think of anybody better who knows their way around a camera than, than Mark. So he, sh he should be here shortly. And uh, we're gonna get some of the car wash scenes here and then we'll probably go somewhere around town to grab uh, some other B-roll and do some other shooting for the car review. But Anyway, just figured I'd do this video as a behind the scenes kind of what we're doing um, behind the camera before you see the actual video. But hope you guys enjoy it. And uh, yeah, gonna continue getting ready. Hey guys, Mark just showed up. Uh, we just started getting talking about uh, the kind of angles and stuff that we wanted to prepare for the video. Um, just shooting around ideas. But right now we're just gonna get ready to move the car out and uh, start getting some stuff for the car wash scene. position got some lemonade sweet yes, thanks bro cheers man to a good video oh that's actually not bad i know right? i was about to say i thought when kids make it it's gonna be super sweet that's actually <laughs> not bad at all you know what they're doing you know in the sunlight it doesn't look that dirty but when you come up close because i went to pick up my dad from the airport and this thing just got slaughtered and bugs and stuff so it actually yeah. needed a cleaning i was actually waiting for this to get some <laughs> cleaning done and now like we might as well get some good b-roll out of it it's actually not bad like a product shot <laughs> all right and then come in close for the the bubbles let me know when you're ready go ahead so this is pretty boring but i promise it's gonna look cool later <laughs> uh, the hood again? The hood again? Yeah. Check this out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You see that? Oh, he showed me. That happened one week me. after oh, I really? bought it. Someone <laughs> door dinged me. Dude, I parked in the back of the parking lot. I went to the gym and I parked like, you know, next to those uh, trees. So you, yeah. there's no one parking next to you. I come back and I'm walking literally this way. And all I see is that. Damn. I mean, fortunately it's on the, this uh, trim and that's what it's there for is to protect against door dings. So I'm either probably gonna make a video of me attempting to repair that. Cause I looked into it and people have done it before. You can repair that, that's not terrible. And worst case scenario, I screw it up so bad I can actually peel this off. Yeah. So, but that's, 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 the only bad thing, like Matt told me, was is like if you were to, you can't just go to Toyota and purchase 
one of those. Yep. It has to come in a full set. So I, I called and I said, yeah. hey, can I get a driver's side rear door trim? That's and they said, crazy. we can't do that. We have to do the whole set, which was like 170 bucks. And I'm like, hey, you know what's no. annoying about the whole thing is like you literally park by yourself isolated. Exactly. Yes. And some jack Wondering that's like, oh, what I'm gonna park next to this guy, right? but like look at like do you have an idea how hard you have to swing your door open to do that like that's what really man it kind of reminds me of like you're in a urinal you know like you always have like when well, there's like four out. urinals yeah like, there's that one dude right. that comes up next to you like right. hey buddy right. I'm like, like what? What I'm like heck? dude there's three other urinals over there why'd you come here yeah, and this one was actually my fault but you can't see this one unless I show you this happened a few days ago. That right there. How'd you do that? I was backing into the garage Damn. and I hit that tote right there. Damn. Just grazed it too. I didn't hit it hard, just grazed it. But um, I think that's a video worthy, uh, content worthy video right there. I'm gonna try to re repair that and just document it and you know, sure. maybe you guys laugh at me because I jacked up my car even more or maybe you know it's a how to and you guys, you know, it helps you guys out. But I got the paint, the body paint, and um, I already know how to do body work because I actually was certified in auto collision repair. I haven't exercised it in years, but I have an idea of what to do. So worst case scenario, I jack it up and I have to pay a couple hundred bucks for someone to actually fix it. <laughs> I can't wait for you guys to see some of these shots that Mark is doing. I mean, this guy is a magic man behind the camera. And he's really only here because I need a second guy who knows how to drive clutch. <laughs> I I was going to call Marvin, but, you know, oh, I want to drive the car tomorrow. <laughs> I mean, he learned. He learned pretty you just quickly. Go around the, the Gold's parking lot. Like yeah, good. I mean, he, he got into second gear. We taught my buddy how to drive clutch. I shouldn't. That would be a good idea for a next video is teaching my friends oh, how to teaching my friends how to drive uh, manual. I mean, it's not hard. Now but I drive 10 speed, but not, um, tr trust me, I really think like in 10 minutes you can get it down. Yeah. But the, the crazy thing is you can learn how to drive my car perfectly mm -hmm. and you can hop into his car and the clutch feel is 100% different. Mm -hmm. Dude, I yeah. got in my car after driving your car that day. I'm home, dude, and I was like, is there something wrong with my clutch? It's like, why dude, is it so heavy? I told you, my honestly, this car is so, and this is what I'm excited to share with you guys. This car is so perfect to learn how to drive manual in because the clutch is so forgiving. Yeah. And then the clutch pedal is, the feel is so light. Is. So that's why I'm saying when I jumped into his car, his clutch is so heavy. I'm like, dude, like, is this broken? Like, <laughs> you know, so it's absolutely crazy the difference between manual transmissions. But that's what makes it fun. Yeah, like I, I, I used to drive trucks, like sticks. So really? I, I would drive those, but then when I get into like actual cars with sticks, I'm just like, yeah. what the fuck, what do I do? <laughs> I've never driven a truck with sticks. weird. You know the Toyota Tacoma, they still make those in manuals? That's awesome, that's actually a truck that I'm looking to get. Yeah, I had yeah, that'd no- That would be a cool truck to get. Dude, I love it, but like my friend got a new 2019 one, and I jumped in, I was like blown to see that thing have a manual transmission. I was like, I had no idea any truck nowadays had a manual transmission. That's crazy. That's awesome. I might throw some B-roll and stuff that we're shooting right now in today's video in this vlog just to spice things up a little bit instead of just us talking about cars. <laughs> just you guys really need to check out these videos that Mark's doing. These things are bangers. But just drawing off the car now and then we're heading to, uh, to the site to get the rest of the videos. He's showing some of his content right now, but like I said, links to all of his stuff is going to be in the description down below. You, you really need to check him out. All right, guys, so we just finished detailing the car here. Well, I did. Mark over there, he's about to catch me rolling out. Uh, got some great shots. So now we're about to drive around, find some spots around town to uh, get some more shots for this video and this review. Uh, got the GoPro set up here. Going to set this one up in the, uh, I was going to say in the cockpit. I just finished flying. Um, in the cabin and uh yeah see what we find so they're gonna be in another car in a chase car grabbing some shots and then you know i have these uh, mount points set up around the vehicle to get some cool shots for you guys so here we go
this is this is really cool guys shooting my first car review this is something I've always wanted to do because I I just love cars and yeah I know this car isn't super exciting it's not a Ferrari it's not a Lamborghini yet and there's Mark getting some uh, nice b-roll there rolling shots yeah I should have had a camera pointing forward right now but he does the most to get the shot and let me tell you it is so worth it but anyway you know this isn't a super exciting a car but I think for what it is and the price point it's at you know those things considered I think it's a pretty fun car but more on that when I actually shoot the review right now we're just getting some rolling shots like I said some b-roll just to make the video look pretty that's really what this is because by myself a lot of these shots I could not get just by myself and if I shot this whole thing by myself I feel like it wouldn't be good enough for me to want to post it on the internet open to criticism and critique but let's be real anytime you post anything on the internet for uh, any reason you're gonna get criticism and critique but so far honestly it's been nothing but love from you guys which is why I was kind of uh, adamant about putting this out it, like really drove me to to continue putting out stuff because I told myself hey 2020 is gonna be the year I actually go ahead and do this YouTube channel what it's gonna be exactly about cars planes I have some uh, aviation themed stuff lined up too but I don't have any single subject per se that this channel is gonna be about and who knows maybe later on that might I might narrow down what the channel is about but for right now I think it's just about creating content just for the fun of it things that interest me um, and sharing them with you guys. So I hope you enjoy it. By the way, I completely forgot Dominic is still on the phone here. So they're probably hearing me talking to myself right now. And I think he's laughing too. All right, I think we got some great stuff from the air. It's getting heated on that basketball court. I think Mark got some great stuff from the air. We're gonna head over to one more spot. And I think that's gonna be wraps for for today at least almost left this camera attached to the side of my car and we're at the uh, we're at the park right now and that well someone easily could have came by and snatched it but not today I'd be really upset but Mark and Dama over there catching uh, some rolling footage of me coming across this little road by the pond I they said it came out amazing and you know I believe them after everything I've seen from them, I'm sure it came out great, so I can't wait for you guys to see that. So how'd it come out? So the first drive by was good, but the yeah. second drive by was much better. I was gonna say that Lincoln was- No, not off. this, not this, but I'm talking about 81. Oh, 81, oh, okay. Yeah. Let me see this out, check this All right, that stuff was, well, what I say, it was, it was gonna be amazing. I just got a sneak peek of it. And again, I'll probably put a little bit of the footage here and there in this video for you guys, but running to the car now because now we're kind of on a time crunch running back to the car to grab a few more cool shots for you and um, I think that'll wrap it up for today with the b-roll and cool angles and all that sort of thing I'm gonna lie this this looks pretty good right here the foreigns right here <laughs> Dom's WRX the Corolla don't know who that is but all right Dom I'll see you later Mark, as always, man, Alrighty, bro. I appreciate it. Take it easy. Guys, like I said, links for him and his stuff all down below in the description. Helped me out a ton and definitely made this video a lot better than what it could have been or if I did it myself. But anyways, take care. Up See and coming YouTuber. <laughs> Stay tuned. See you guys in the next one.